I'm Jaspreet Chowdhury with the Ballot Initiative Strategy Center. I'm excited to partner with the State Innovation Exchange's Democracy Project to talk to you about ballot measures, why you as a progressive legislator should care about this important tool, and how you can identify and disrupt common tactics conservatives deploy to undermine direct democracy. Very simply, a ballot measure or ballot initiative is direct democracy a place where eligible voters can make decisions about policies that impact them in their daily lives. Advocates use ballot measures to win public policy that has stalled under the dome, or to apply pressure or to raise awareness about an important topic or change the underlying narrative about an important issue. Ballot measures should be understood as complementary, not oppositional to your daily work inside the Capitol. We all win when legislators work with advocates to move progressive policy. Ballot measures come in many forms, depending on the state. Most common are citizen-initiated ballot measures and legislatively referred ballot measures. 24 states have citizen-initiated ballot measures, which allow voters to propose and enact new state statutes and or constitutional amendments. Legislatively referred ballot measures allow lawmakers to send constitutional or statutory questions to voters for approval. While conservatives also use ballot measures to advance their goals, progressive advocates nationwide are harnessing the power of the initiative to expand opportunities for all communities, black, white, and brown, across red, blue, and purple states. In 2018 alone, the people of Idaho, Nebraska, and Utah voted to expand Medicaid and provide health care access to thousands of people. Washington enacted comprehensive gun safety reforms, Michigan legalized marijuana, and Florida, Maryland, Michigan, and Nevada expanded voting access for millions of Americans. These are incredible policy victories where voters join together to demand a better future, shared prosperity, and racial justice. The ballot measure process made all these wins possible. Ballot measures can also enrich our democracy and encourage civic participation. Voters of color disproportionately say they would be more enthusiastic about voting, knowing that progressive initiatives were on their ballot. Legislators are key stakeholders in this process. Legislators set the rules that allow initiatives to qualify for the ballot and become law. And while ballot measures are not the only tactic to win progressive change, they are a crucial tool for our movement that legislators should understand and fight to protect. With legislators' help, we can defend direct democracy and protect a key lever of progressive change. Here are five ways to engage and learn more. One. When considering changes to your ballot measure process, check with local progressive allies, BISC and SIX, to make sure you don't inadvertently create barriers to direct democracy. Two, help advocates draft language for ballot measures that is politically and legally sound. When legislators and advocates team up, ballot measures are more likely to withstand challenges and less likely to be undermined. Three, Email us to learn more about your state's ballot measure process, threats, and how to fight back. Four, become a six democracy champion. Visit stateinnovation.org backslash democracy to learn more and join the fight. Five, join the BIS listserv to receive the latest news on ballot measures.